Dear fellas, stop approaching independent women with nothing to offer. But this, because a real independent woman gets disgusted. Uh, a chick like me, I will right up on your shoe, baby, for real. Okay, so don't come over here with that. Okay, you already know what it is. Uh, I don't go off of uh, words. I go off actions. And if you ain't showing no action, I'm going to think you don't like me. And you're going to get cussed out. Straight up. Okay. I'm still Mrs. Nice Girl. But I can get ignorant too. Okay. Because it's, it's, it's really annoying. We are already independent, okay? I don't want no love. Fuck love. I get love from my children. I show my children love. They show me love back, okay? Now that that's established. I don't want no shrimp. I don't want no eggplant. I can get that from Cindy's or Pleasure Zone. Let's be clear. If you know, you know. I'm talking about them things to make us do some things that y'all can't. Y'all really can, but y'all don't be trying. Y'all be for yourself. And then you want to look at us crazy when we for ourselves. But that's what it takes. Why you think we independent? That's what we need. Don't be a dependent. Don't depend on us for the Meow. If you ain't got the mm mm. And I'm just saying, y'all can call it what you want. But you look real silly going around giving up that meow to anybody that want it. You understand? I was taught that it's a precious gift. You ain't supposed to give it to nobody. You really weren't supposed to give it to nobody but your husband. But hey, Jesus died for our sins. Everybody make mistakes. So hey, that ain't that's it ain't it's not like that anymore, okay? But you best believe these ninjas gonna talk a good game. Don't let them approach you if you independent with nothing to offer. Look. I'm sorry, y'all. I got the. Uh, uh, uh. You get the picture. 